Yo, 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 what is good, YouTube? It is your boy Mech America Lit back with another NBA 2K23 video. And in today's video, I'm making you guys another episode of NBA Player Builds. And as you can see on screen, in today's episode, we are going to be recreating Minnesota Timberwolves on Anthony Edwards, otherwise known as Ant Man. So let's just jump straight into his build. Uh, Anthony Edwards is 6'4", 225 pounds, plays the shooting guard slash small forward position for the Minnesota Timberwolves. He wears the jersey number one, and he has a 6'9 wingspan. His attributes are as follows. He has a 93 layup, a 50 standing dunk, a 95 driving dunk, a 79 close shot, an 84 mid-range, a 79 three ball, 76 free throw with a 62 post control, 74 pass accuracy with an 84 ball handle, 83 speed with ball, 50 interior defense, 74 perimeter defense, 59 still 57 block 37 offensive rebound 56 defensive rebound with an 89 speed and acceleration a 52 strength an 86 vert and an 89 stamina for his badge count he has gold fast twitch limitless takeoff and posterizer with silver fearless finisher and slithery with bronze acrobat aerial wizard bully and giant slayer he also has silver midi magician and volume shooter with bronze amp comeback kid and slippery off ball uh, for his playmaking he has bronze clamp breaker and quick first step and then for defense he has bronze pogo stick so there you have it um we was able to get his body settings proper 6'4 225 with a 69 wingspan for body shape i went with defined and then as you can see his badge layout we was pretty much able to get uh all his badges we were able to get pretty much almost all his attributes um wasn't able to get to a 95 driving dunk just because of his height or whatever but if you do want the 95 driving dunk you're just gonna have to make his wingspan a little bit longer if you go up to a 610 wingspan uh you'll get that 95 driving dunk you obviously won't have his exact build because he has a 6-9 wingspan but if you care that much about having like the extra it's not going to do anything bad for you it's just going to increase uh you know the defensive stuff and the finishing it'll take down your shooting but he doesn't have max shooting on this build anyway so it doesn't really matter you're still going to be able to get to an 84 mid-range and a 79-3 so it's not going to harm you at all to go up to 6-10 on a wingspan if you do choose to uh we were able to get his playmaking attributes and then uh i had to skim a little bit on his defensive uh stats or whatever like that uh just so that i can get you know his um vertical and his stamina and stuff like that and even then uh because he has such high uh you know finishing and stuff like that and the playmaking i wasn't able to get exactly to his stats but if you do care to get you know exactly to his physicals you could take the speed with ball down some you know what i'm saying you could take the speed with ball down some and then you could put like those two points into his speed to get his 89 speed and the rest you could throw into his vertical to get to that 86 vertical but i felt like it wasn't that big of a deal we still had his 74 perimeter defense and his 55 55 steel which is basically his 59 steel um another thing you can do is you could bring his perimeter defense down to 70 70 since 74 ain't gonna really get you any of these badges as long as you have like a 70 threshold pretty sure uh you know going down to 70 isn't gonna take anything uh away from you or whatever for these badges so what you could do is you could go to bring your perimeter defense down to 70 bring your speed with ball down to like an 80 and then put those points into your speed and your vertical giving you like an 86 or whatever and then put that plus one to his stamina for an 89 stamina if you care to have like you know most of his physicals and stuff like that if you don't care to do all of that then you don't have to you can leave it just like that but our final batch count is going to be 23 finishing 21 shooter and 20 playmaking with six defensive and then for the takeover, you have your choice between slash and take, shot creating take, and play take. I went with slash and shot creating because I feel like that's mostly what Anthony Edwards does. You know, he's a bucket. And then you'll see that we have created a inside the arc scorer with shades of, of course, Anthony Edwards at the very top. So there you have it. This is my NBA 2K23 Anthony Edwards build. It's been your boy Make America Lit. Please be sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe for more NBA 2K23 content. I'm out, guys. Peace.